The man who spent a month in a coma after a severe beating at the Harris County Jail is now suing the county, claiming federal civil rights violations. It's the latest in a string of suits calling for changes at the Harris County Jail after a record number of deaths last year and comes one day after the FBI said it was investigating two deaths at the jail. KPRC 2 Sion Rhodes live in the newsroom with the newest information. Sion. And today that man is in a rehabilitation hospital trying to recover from a severe brain injury that left him unable to walk or talk. The lawsuit claims the jail is refusing to release any videos or reports related to the incident and that they have not started an internal affairs investigation. Adael Garcia was arrested the day before Thanksgiving for an outstanding misdemeanor warrant. The day after Thanksgiving, his family says one or more guards at the Harris County Jail beat him so brutally he was in a coma for one month. This was all caused because of their negligence. Garcia now suing Harris County for civil rights violations. His family hoping the case will force officials to release more details about what happened. We are sick of waiting. We just want to get this solved. We haven't received any kind of answers. This jail has very severe problems. Garcia's attorney Randall Kalanen says the county never filed charges against Garcia and the misdemeanor warrant was dropped. 60% of the people in the jail here are not convicted of anything. They're just awaiting their trial. So you can have innocent people in this jail right now and they can be killed either from guards, from other inmates that are dangerous, or from poor medical care. All because of the overcrowding, the underfunding, and the lack of discipline. It makes me feel angry because it can happen to any of us. We just don't want this to happen to anybody else. We did reach out to the Harris County Attorney and the Sheriff's Office. Both agencies had no comment. Live in the newsroom, Sion Rhodes, KPRC 2 News.